cooking up skills that will last a lifetime. This summer, teens in Syracuse had hands-on training in the kitchen learning about food and safety. News Channel 9's Iris St. Moran tells us more about the Who Wants Smoked Barbecue and Catering Internship Program. Tamika Barnett wears many hats in the community, but she's had the title of cook most of her life. So it started with cutting up the collard greens. I was always as a child responsible for cutting up the greens and then like I'm the youngest of three girls, so I don't have any brothers. So I spent a lot of time with my father and he is the grill master. Now she is one too. Last summer, Barnett started her own business, Who Wants Smoke, a mobile catering business specializing in barbecue. I have a smoker that's welded to a trailer so I can pretty much pull up anywhere in the city and provide the residents of our great community with the best barbecue in town. She also wanted to provide youth in the community a chance to learn the business. This summer she launched an internship program where she mentored 16 interns between the ages of 14 and 18. Before they even began cooking, interns learned how to handle food safely and are now Serve Safe certified. On their last day, they prepared meatballs. Arissa Mack shared her favorite dish. I could make chicken alfredo, but I like the way she make it because I used to make it out the can. She learned how, she taught me how to make it from scratch. Now that the internship program has ended, each participant is given a basket with some kitchen essentials, including a measuring cup, apron and cutting board and a certificate. Barnett, who was also a fire lieutenant, made sure they also had CPR and AED training. So that they know what to do in the event of an emergency. You're giving us life skills that we're going to need in the future. It's certainly a recipe for success. In Syracuse, Iris St. Moran, News Channel 9.